Gamakatsu B10S in size 2 odd has been secured in the vise. Now a thread, uh, a UTC 140D is started up behind the hook eye and wrapped down until covering half of the hook shank. A length of lead free wire is secured and wrapped up again. leaving some space behind the eye of the hook. The wire is covered with wraps of uh, the tying thread. Leave the thread hanging behind the wire. Now some cactus chenille. It is uh, secured behind the thread and then wrapped a couple of times and then uh, secured again. Now a few uh, fibers of crystal flash is selected. are made uneven and the fibers are secured on the middle of the length then doubled and secured again. Now the crystal flash uh, is secured under wraps of the chenille and it is wrapped up the shank the same length as, as the wire before. While doing this I try to push back the fibers of the chenille before the next turn. Not that that really matters. You tie off, you cut off the, cut off the excess. There. And turn the hook around. A small bundle of uh, Steve Farris flash blend uh, fibers in the shrimp color is, is selected and it's doubled and tied in. The length here is about the length of the crystal flash. Try to even the fibers around the lower half of the hook shank. A tip here is to try to imagine a tapered fish body as you go along with uh, each bundle of SF fibers to come. It will minimize the need for scissors later. You top off the strip collar with a few SF fibers in white. And a drop of Sabagap will keep things in place. Now turn the hook again and spread out the fibers further to ensure they cover the lower 180 degrees of the fly. Select a slightly bigger bunch of SF fibers uh, in off-white and secure them on the middle part of the fibers of the length. Try to ease out the fibers so they cover the, the top 180 degrees of the hook shank. And add a drop of glue here for, for ease of tying.
double the fibers and secure again. Length of these fibers is to extend beyond the crystal flash and the, the, the belly of the fish, so to speak. Add another drop of glue. Now select a small bundle of uh, SF fibers in grey and secure them just like before. Again with attention towards the profile of the, of the fly. Now tidy up the head of the fly with some neat thread wraps and then after that tie off. With a grey marker Color the upper part of the header thread. Here one might add a bit of color to the front part of the SF fibers as well. Now a, a flat stick on eye is placed on either side of the hook, a bit from the head of thread. Here one can, with the fingers, easily feel if the eyes are positioned right. Place the fly on the side and add a layer of UV glue first on top of the eye, then continuing further in a line until reaching the head of the, uh, the head of thread, the head of the fly. Hit it with the UV torch instantly. One can repeat this step for a more solid connection from eye to head. This is repeated on the other side. And pinching down the, the SF fibers while gluing the eyes will give the fly a narrow profile. And if you feel for it, you can go over the head of the fly again with some glue, filling out any gaps, spots.
The illusion of gills is made with a red marker. The fly is now placed on a piece of paper, paper towel or whatever is around. First thing is to color the tail. An orange marker is used on either side of the rear end of the fly. On a centimeter, two centimeters at the back. The orange is followed by a red marker, which is used on top of the orange, uh, but just on the part uh, towards the body, towards the head of the fly, where it's already orange. This leaves an orange tail section with a bit of that distinct red uh, characterizing a tigerfish tail. Dots made with a black marker in lines from head to tail, from back to belly, gives at least a slight impression of lines or stripes, since we're tying a tiger fish here. It is of course done on either side as well. Finally, a few light strokes with a black and then a dark olive marker on top of the back will finish off the fly. Trim the fly to desired shape. Not much trimming is needed if one focus on creating a fish ship when securing each bundle of the SF fibers along the way during the tying of the fly. <laughs> 